Hey everyone, welcome back to this quick update video. In this video, I'm just going to show you how to fix a bug with the timer in our stamina system. It's not a major issue and doesn't affect gameplay in any way, but I'd realized after recording my previous video that there's a much better way to stop our timer once our character's stamina has completely regenerated. And just to give you an idea of what the issue is here, what I'll do is I'll add a print string node and connect it up to the execution output of the set timer by event and then I'll right click and type get current stamina then connect it up to the print string like so now if I press play what you'll notice is that the timer will actually continue running in the background after our stamina has regenerated and won't stop until the next time the stop sprinting event is triggered so a better way to do this is if I cut this chunk of code here, then go into our stamina cycle manager function and paste it just at the end of the regenerate stamina branch of logic. If you remember, we have this drain stamina cycle boolean that I never ended up utilizing, but we're going to utilize it now. So we'll place a get drain cycle started node here and connect it up to a branch to confirm that the drain stamina cycle was started. So we'll add that now we're checking this just to ensure that we don't inadvertently invalidate our timer before we've actually started draining our stamina and then uh, we'll connect this up to this branch here so now every time the regenerate stamina logic executes um, it will run a check to see if stamina is full and if it is full then it will clear the timer and the last thing we need to do here is set our drain cycle started boolean back to false after the timer has been cleared So now if we play, you'll notice that as soon as our stamina fully regenerates, the print string node no longer fires, meaning that our timer has been stopped. I've also gone ahead and also updated the free project file for this tutorial. So if you'd like to download this project file for free, you can download it from the link in the description. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.